Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Uh, sorry about the last couple of videos. Um, having a bit of a problem with the computer and corrupt files, video files. So I've tried like four or five times to upload the previous one. So sorry about that. I'm just about to head off to the supermarket to do the grocery shopping for the week. Then I'm going to head down to JB and pick up what I said I was going to maybe pick up last time if you saw it stereo stuff stay tuned hi guys been thinking about uh, what to do with the heads I think I'm just gonna get valves and springs you know, once I've collected all of those parts over a weekend I'll pull the engine out and redo the heads and hopefully it's all good I'm thinking of maybe going plus one millimeter on the valves, but that means I'd have to get different pistons, and that's the bottom end. So I'll just stick with the valves and springs to begin with, and um, yeah. So in the next month or so, I'll start collecting them, and. Um, Hopefully we can get this cause working a bit better. <laughs> I have finished grocery shopping. I'm going to head off to Jimmy Hi-Fi to get some stereo stuff. There we go guys. Picked up some 4 inch speakers for the back. So I'll put them in in upcoming video. At home, we get this shopping put away and pick up Molly. All right, got the little man. Say hi. <laughs> uh, what are we gonna do? Go home? Yeah, we're gonna head home. Probably play some PlayStation, watch some um, YouTube. What else? work on the car maybe put some speakers in yeah radiator as well so it's a, it's at its hottest point see so guys just got home but ah, the factory one doesn't move so I don't know what's going on play some PlayStation what are we playing? Um, Marvel game. Alright guys, it is the next day. I'm going to use the lead light. Um, and we're in the other side of the garage because it is pretty windy out there. So I'm going to use the spot shop light. LED shop light for the first time. Um, I've got one of my subscribers asking if it's easy to hook up like under bonnet so I'll do that as well but we're just going to be putting those speakers in it's pretty easy just four screws pull out the old kickers and put in the new cadence ones that I got let's do it 
Alright guys, so I'll go quickly through this uh, shop light. So I've got battery in there. It can also be, well not while the battery's in, you can plug uh, extension lead in here. So I've got the light, it's pretty bright. This can fold, oh you can change it. <coughs> so one side, I'm guessing you could, yep, change the other one, and then off. So up here, these fold out. You got little hooks. So same here. So then you can hang them up, which I'll show you a bit later. Alright guys, put the light on. Uh, it's pretty dark on this side of the garage. So we just need to cut these off. And we just got these four screws to take out. And uh, the cadence one should just go straight back in. We've got like four different yeah. four different screws in there. Silly Glen. Alright. <laughs> this is my little dodgy job I did the oh, about a month or so ago. Because uh these tweeters weren't working. And that came off. It uh, melted off actually. Alright, so. I'm gonna get some cadence ones out. Mounting hardware just fell out. I've got some wire. It's always good to have extra wire. Ooh. Come with this the cover which I won't use. Yes, the speaker. Oops. <laughs> Looks so much smaller now. So yeah, these are only fifty bucks. Um, there were also some Sony Explode. Uh, three way, four inch ones, but yeah, not really too concerned. Looks like a good unit. So, it should go all right. Got a peak power of a hundred watts. Let's get these back in. All right. Voila! Done! Exactly the same for the other side. We'll do a little, well, kind of a product review on this shop light from Ryobi. So, pretty decent. It's, um, I think the lights are about 20, 200 mil. 200 mil each. Can turn both on, one on, top one. Makes it a lot easier to see things in the engine bay. We do have these hooks, so you can mount them. So, and you can hang them as well. Not only mount, but there we go. So, or 
can have it that way. Let's see. Hey! There goes Super Guys. The holes in the bonnet are perfect. That makes things a lot easier. Yeah. Can also just do one side at a time. Yeah. Pretty good investment. Um, also, let's slide them in and yeah, change the light. So, have it sitting over here. Oh, have it sitting over here. With just the top one on, so you're not getting blinded, which you guys are probably are. <laughs> it is. Nearly midday, put the garage door down. This is the side of the garage that we'll be working in most of the time, so yeah, it's uh, definitely a good investment for working on the car and also doing better, clearer videos. And if you do run out of battery, you can plug it in too. So all you need to do is take that out, flip that across, you can plug your mains power straight in. Yeah. I like it. Let's see how it goes with just one. That's good. Yeah. Really good. Definitely worth the, the $99. And let's see if it can fit in at the back. Ah, that's facing down. Oh. Silly, I'm just laying it down. Good. I like it. She could even uh, take it camping. Look all the way around. It's directional. Or blind yourself. Yeah. I'm going to leave that one here, you guys. Thanks for watching. Let's see if we can get some good. There we go. Thanks for watching guys, um, hopefully the next up will be the fittings, they should come in today or tomorrow, and yeah, um, might head out now and get some paint, the intercooler, yeah, catch you next time, bye.